Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Creeper World. For that is right, we are back heading into the comedy section yet again for a new game mode, apparently. Uh, it is C4D Force Investigation. Tasked to investigate a research planet that has gone quiet. You stumble upon something very familiar and cliche. And we're immediately put in FPS mode on load. So it's a pure FPS map. Yet again, a new game mode. Oh my, it's a new game mode, everybody. That's very exciting. I'm much most happy with how well this turned out. However, map sizes are limited due to my laptop's capabilities. Very understandable. Sad, oh, well, sad, really, but I think it's very, it's, it's understandable. Um, hope you all like this one. Feedback's always appreciated. Creep for Dead by Literal Noob and Caden. Uh, v Decoration by Virtue and Scripting Company and many others. So this is the Creep for Dead, the C4D. Uh, I'm guessing this is Left 4 Dead. There you go. Uh, that is my gaze, of course. Uh, Ship by Virtue, the CW4 Modder, not the Empire. Uh, let's take it. Let's take a read of this. It looks like those are the two snipers that are following us. You are now arriving at Redacted Island. Your mission here is to investigate why this research planet has gone silent. Oh my! The research planet focused on biological research. We're not letting you drop in blind. It should give you an idea of what may attack you. You should be accompanied by two halo cards. Those are the payload cards. Look at that. Uh, with snipers. Uh, you shouldn't be... There shouldn't be anything needed for you to collect at this time. Namely intel. So no caches. No intel caches for us to collect. Without further ado, start investigating when you arrived. Alright. Uh, and we can hit C. Boop. And that will... you. That, that's good. I like it. Uh, we can't start shooting. I cannot shoot right now. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what the map is like. Looks like we're landing. Alright, alright, alright. We can move. Can we shoot? Uh, okay, we can start shooting. There we go. Let's just shoot the creep down. Easy peasy. Alright, I like it. Can we do it? Alright. AC doesn't really... Well, it's kind of going. It's not really... Ooh. Oh, we want to... Oh, we can... Whoa. CD4 FPS changes required to read. Holy moly. Turn off music, lower sound effects. Turn off music. Or turn of, but I'm assuming it's off. Uh, Canan. The Canan has been increased fire rate and can now damage snipable enemies. You can call it a submachine gun. Rec recommended to use for light hordes. Does not fare well with large hordes. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Interesting. The mortar, it can uh, damage multiple snipable targets. You can call it a granada. So the mortar is a grenade. The canan is an SMG. Got it. The sprayer, AC can now slow. Oh, the AC is like a slowing effect. Interesting. Slow down enemies and increases the AC speed spread distance uh always spread this before triggering switches interesting so it's like that's really cool game messages use the reset camera key behind to close them uh which is c i believe um horde barrier plot armor what is that if you're surrounded by too many enemies or you're trying to run through a horde you will be held down or stopped letting the enemy attack you hmm. you can still dash away use it press shift to escape captivity okay um, we only have one life. This map has player death cutscene. Reload system feature in the future. And yes, I will compensate waiting to reload with something. Good. Interesting. Very cool. Okay, so wait. Uh, oh no! We, 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 uh, submachine gun. Whoa! We are getting shot. So submachine gun. Yeah, we can, oh, we can literally just shoot zombies. Okay. Uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, Commander, this place seems to be overrun with these green things. You better be prepared. They could be anywhere. Okay. Well, don't... We lost one of our... We already lost a sniper. That doesn't seem fair. We lost both of our snipers. You're useless to me. So AC doesn't really spread, but it's a slowing mechanic. That is interesting. And I think that means... Okay, we have to snipe those. Random PU survivor. Ah, don't shoot, don't shoot. I'm not one of them. Oh, 
Mr. Marine. Uh, hi there. I'll follow you for survival. All right, just follow me. That's fine. I'm very happy with that. That being said, uh, all of my other... Oh, wait, they're back. My snipers are back. Yay! All right, let's, uh, let's just keep going. Fantastic. Oh. Thankfully, we have a submachine gun, and the mortar is more of a granat. Maybe I should mortar when there's, like, like, because there were, like, five or six of them together. Maybe that's when you mortar. Seems like the submachine gun is going pretty well, though. So right now, seems like submachine gun is kind of the thing. It also looks like creeper flow is essentially non-existent. As you can see, this creep is sort of, it just sort of is what it is. So I'm not really, oh, wait, how do I open? Is this how I open that? Do I have to climb this little staircase? Oop. Oh, nope, that right. didn't really work very well. Wubba, 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 come on. I want to open this. Do I shoot it? What do I do? How do I open this door? Oh, right there. <laughs> oh no, I'm on the other side. Mortar, right, grenade. This is, yes, this is prime grenade time. Commander, watch out. Red, oh, ooh, ooh, I wanna read. Uh, red lips are coming, hold your ground. Okay, yeah, that's, that's one, that's one. All right. So we were grenading, and grenading works pretty well for these hordes, as you can see. Although, I'm kinda holding my ground. Oh, there we go. We're still alive. We're still good. We are good. Okay. Okay. Very cool. Okay. So shift is like a dash. Oh, geez. That's a minute. Oh, wait. This is backwards? Whoops, Daisy. Going the wrong way. See, I'm already at a loss. This is very, very cool. Holy moly. I love dash mechanics. I'm not going to lie. I'm a big old FromSoft fan. I'm not going to. I cannot help it. So, you know, dodging and dashing and rolling and all of that stuff. Oh, geez, I, I have the reading to do. Uh, is someone over th the gate open? Your that voice commander. Or that voice. Uh, I was going to say commander. Commander. That voice sounds familiar to me. Track it, Marine. Roger. Tracking signal. Orange. Oh, my gosh. There we go. Uh, honestly speaking, just shooting all this, a little bit of a shame. Probably don't need to, but at the same time, we have a lot of friends on carts behind us, so maybe we should, just for them. Realistically, we could dodge through it, right? Oh, better. Oh, we, we have a message from a veteran snipe. I never expected someone to visit this place so soon. That suit. Are you Mr. Marine? You're here to investigate why this planet has gone quiet. I would love to help, but... The radio station was overrun. We couldn't send an SOS message at all. Say, before you enter the facility, you clean, could you clean up the area? Creep? Those weird green things seem to be Baxter. Oh, so... So, while AC slows them down, Creep will speed up the zombies. I see, that makes sense. Okay. And we've been cleaning it up because I wanted to clean it up for my carts, but it's actually a good thing because it speeds up zombies. Good to know. Um, you can trust a Marine. It's a facility guard coordinator. I'm still worried what happened to the facility. Very cool. Okay, so creep isn't really damaging. I mean, I guess it does hurt things, but realistically creep is more of a speed increase for the enemy. Oh, I really like that. That's a very neat uh, mechanic. Uh, boom. There we go. We shoot shoot the dots to keep going. Mr. Marine, I also forgot to tell you something. That blast door takes two minutes to open. Sorry for the inconvenience. Our maintenance team was busy repairing important stuff, and it looks like those green driving. Help me defend this position. Oh, why? Uh, oh, by the way, my name is Leah. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Marine, defend the position with Althea. Copy, Commander. Miss Althea, I'll defend with you. Huh? Oh, we can't even use the mortar. No. Okay, okay. Let's let's drop some AC, and we're going command, right? So we need to drop some AC. Yeah, see, the AC is super good, right? So I should have dropped the AC before. Keep some AC everywhere, right? 
go back to some command. So it slows them down. We don't have access to our mortar right now. It is... Oh, I never turned off the sound. The music. Uh, well, it's, it's fine. Honestly, I don't think the music is really doing that bad. Uh, but I will admit, I do think I really like the fact that the AC is sort of a slowing field. So having this down is, like, huge. So keep it down. Keep it all around. And keep blowing them up, right? So, yeah, we're able to slow them down. Keep them going with our SMG. And it's going to take two minutos. That's fine. That's fine. Right, so we'll we'll toss some more AC down, some more AC. Everyone's had AC. Yeah. I'm happy. Mr. Marine, your numbers look more dense. I don't know what's going on. Do you have something like explosives? I've grenades. Infinite one to two. Why is it only working? Oh, we oh we have we have our mortars. We have mortars. There we go. Oh my gosh, the lag, the mortar lag. That's amazing. <laughs> we have a bit of lag with using mortars, but we can start using them. Thankfully, we put down plenty of AC, because without this, this would be ridiculous. And honestly, I think the music, I love that, like, that, like, I don't know, the, the high notes that are hitting in this song right now, I think it's perfect for this moment. Uh, granted, the lag is a little rough, right? Um... It hurts. So the lag hurts. Look at look at the timer. It's taking like multiple seconds for a second to go by a timer. Um, that's okay. That's okay. You know, it's understandable. There is a lot of zombies spawning, and there's a lot of things going on. I think this is a very cool, neat game mode. Uh, it's very different than anything else. And we have a dodge, right? Bazow! Bazow! So dodges are very cool. Uh, let's toss some more AC down at the front. Oh my gosh, the lag! And more, more mortar, okay? Oh, jeez. Uh, come on. Scientists are still alive and waiting rescue ever since. If you're here, then it could calm them. But first, we need to do something about the reactor and the facility. Just follow her words, Marie. Seems like you're going for another side mission. Good luck in there. As you and Althea enter the facility, commander's signal, uh, the commander's signal connection is cut off. He bids you good luck for whatever you're going to do next. Well, what do you think you're going to do then? And this is a long message from Literal Lou, which is very cool. Hi, hello, this is me. So how did the map turn out? Fun? Easy? Too short for enjoyment? Well, whatever you fe felt, I'm happy you liked this map. Tell me what you think about this game mode. Provide suggestions, feedback, etc. FPS base defense is back on track. If you didn't understand that, I'm going to make an FPS wave defense map. FPS cave exploration may well, uh, maybe will on hold for a long time. Ooh, a long time. Interesting. Rant incoming. I'm not sure most casual CW4 player base don't like actual FPS missions. So, okay. Or I'm sure, or not sure. Um, this was discussed this was discussed by multiple people back in the Discord. I'll say my opinion of why casual players in the player base don't like real FPS missions. For me, I think why the casual player don't like real FPS missions is because they grew up with it. Over time, when FPS grew with popularity back in CW4's peak time, pretty much everyone got used to cleanup missions. I call for maps that just involve you cleaning the map from creep or nullifying all enemies in the map. Basically, pre people grew up with simple become overpowered over time to obliterate every creep into non-existence maps. And plus many others so that CW4 players don't like significant changes to what they're used to. Well, yes. But us map creators want people to experience a new kind of change. Like this map, for example. So please, try something new. For me, the map creators, including me, have a very innovative minds. They were merely put aside something by the majority of casual players just because they aren't used to the change that was made 
to what they like slash got used to. Many others said they make maps slash scripts based on what they like now. And maybe you should try sympathizing with what the map creators have in mind. Thank you for reading or listening. Thank you for trying something new. So this is definitely something new. Um, whoa, whoa. Um, you did well, Mr. Marine. The blast doors are open. Follow me quickly. <laughs> I, read, I read all that knife history. Uh, Marine, follow her words. I won't be able to reach you underground. Good luck in there. I didn't even realize this message came. So I wish I read this message first. That's my only complaint, literal noob, is I wish you gave me time to read this message first. Uh, because I feel like that message kind of sums up quite a lot. Um, that being said, I have to say this is incredible. I mean, I never would have expected zom a zombie horde to be coming in, right? This is mind-blowing. So I have, to, I have to say that that is wild. I hope people do enjoy it. Um, apparently we have fire rate buff, by the way. Uh, just saying, we do like seeing that. Um, but yes, this is, it's truly incredible what map makers are bringing. And while I completely understand that there are people that will complain about any map that is being made, right? It, this map is not for me. Why? Is, this is not a real creeper for creeper world map, blah, blah, blah. As long as you make it and enjoy it, that's all that truly matters. Every map maker, whether it's the best map in the world or literally just a square with an emitter and just some things. If you are doing it because you enjoy to do it, please, please keep doing it because every map is appreciated. Some may be simple. Some may be complex with who knows how many layers of code. I cannot imagine the layers of code for this. I, literally for my job, I code and have a database and do things, and I could never think to do something like this, right? Mind-blowing. So I just want to say thank you to every coder. That is you, literal noob. That is Kali. That is Virtu. That is Tricky Corp. That, you know, every single one. I, I, I could go on naming so many mo more. You know, Buttercat. So many more. Uh, Quopal. I, I'm not going to say any more names. I, I can literally keep going. There are so many more. Um, I literally hit my M button in anticipation. I just want to say thank you to every single one of you. This is a huge, huge thank you because it's not easy. It is not. It is a labor of love. It is a labor, labor of care. It is, a, it is something for someone else and you are doing incredible. So, again, and again, this is not even just to the people doing the scripts. If you just make a map that is a square with an emitter and something else, thank you. Because you were trying to make something for someone else to enjoy. And I truly, truly want to just stress how amazing it is just to try and bring enjoyment to someone else. That's all I try to do with videos, right? I, like, I don't think I'm that good, right? I, I just try to, you know, show something off, you know, show off some maps, show off something like this. Every person is incredible. And thank you all so very much. So that's a little bit of a rant and I apologize. <laughs> but I do want to say thank you to everybody, especially if you've watched this as well. Um, you know, thank you for that. Uh, we actually did pretty good on time, <laughs> uh, time-wise, as we do get to the time at the end. I mean, apparently we did pretty decent, you know? Uh, so there you go. Oh, gosh, I'm just like embarrassed now. Uh, but, yes, uh, thank you to everybody. Uh, oh, jeez, there's so many. I, I just want to say, it, it's incredible. So thank you, everybody. Thank you for watching and enjoying, if you did. If you didn't enjoy, well, thank you anyway. Because you know what? Anything, you know, I, I just thank you for your time. That's all that matters. And yes, have a wonderful day to everybody. Every single person. I want you to have a wonderful day. A fantastic day. And I want you to uh, try this map out and kill some zombies. Because there's many zombies that need to kill. And beat my time, because apparently only one... Wait, one? 
two, oh, 341. Holy moly. Two, three, three people beat my time. Four. There's a fourth. There's a fourth. All right. I want there to be more. I want there. So give this map some love and have a wonderful day. I'll catch you next time. Take care.